I know. I know who you people are. I know my constituency made up conservatives politically and Christians religiously. I know what you are, and I also know what kind of a world we live in. And it's a world where Christians have for some reason felt that they're not even allowed to speak about the very physical attributes of the very body that you believe your Father in heaven invented and made. It's all context, folks. Context. If anybody should be leading the moral charge as to the way we're made and why we're this way, it should be the stinking church, not the government, and certainly not public schools. So grow up, church people. We're the ones that should be telling our kids the differences. Because I know that men and women are different physically because I had a big sister. <laughs> and one Christmas came and she got a girl's bike and I got a boy's bike. <laughs> Do they still do it like that? I don't know. But let me tell you what it used to be like. A girl's bike was a bike just like mine, except it had a big slot right through the middle so she could just pop right on. Boy's bike, on the other hand, had an iron bar that started right from under your seat, went directly here, and was welded right there. And the first time you took it out there and your feet slipped off the pedals, you knew you were a boy. That's the difference. And my sister thought it was funny. <laughs> that is what is so, just so bizarre about the way that boys and girls are raised. The way they're raised. Because my sister actually used to kick me there, right in the gro groin ear. I just like, because uh, we've got uh, church people here. Yeah, I, I don't know what you call it. Loins, okay, loins. That's in the Bible. Now what are you gonna do? <laughs> I apologize for <laughs> my sister kicked me in the loins. And you know what's weird? My mother taught her that. <laughs> what kind of a freak was my mother, actually? Because what did they teach the boys? Never hit a girl, never hit a girl, never, 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 never hit a girl. <laughs> to the girl, if a boy bothers you, kick him where it counts. <laughs> I was raised in a Christian home. That's what we call it. Kick them where it counts. Like they kept gore. Two points. <laughs> and it hurt. And the girls laugh every single time a guy gets kicked in the loins. That's a big funny joke. Oh, my sister was so smug about it. So smug, not understanding anything about the physiology of a boy. Oh, it can't hurt so bad. Just like it feels like when we get hit in the chest. Yeah, it's just like when a girl gets hit in the chest. Yeah, but just like when we get hit in the chest. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, it's not like getting hit in a gland at all. It's an organ. You want to feel it, ladies? It's easy. Take your eyes, pull them out, hang them here, do this. There you go. <laughs> understand it. And yet my religion teaches me that God said, let's reason together. You can ask me things. You can talk to me about things. And some things that you're not going to understand, I've done for a reason, for a purpose. And finally, it made sense to me. Finally, it all came clear to me that he made us differently that way to prove that the way that he created us was exactly like he said in the Bible. Because think about it. God's not stupid. He knows what he's doing. Every other organ in a, boy, in a boy's body, his heart, his liver, his spleen, protected by his rib cage. What went wrong? Nothing went wrong. The one stinking rib he took to make you was the one protecting my loins. That that's what went wrong. So be appreciative. And I would reason. I would say, God, I've been cursed. When he said, Feareth not of what dost thou meaneth, Lordeth? 
I've cursed the woman as, as well as. And it's what it's worth. I haven't noticed it is at all. I always speak to the Lord in King James. <laughs> you know, so he'll understand me. <laughs> Come on. Haven't you seen the movies? Jesus is from England. <laughs> but Lord, I've been physically cursed. I've cursed the woman as well. I've altered their hand-eye coordination. I've never noticed it. Oh, oh, you mean the throwing the ball. <laughs> no, but that is funny. No, from henceforth, women cannot apply eye makeup without opening their mouth. You want to laugh? Duct tape their mouth shut. <clears throat> <laughs>